Tumo is a space, uh, a place where teenagers from 12 to 18 year old come. It's an after school program. They come to absorb, to develop themselves in the art and technologies areas. Uh, we offer a range of very interesting courses here. But the intention is to get these young adults to experiment and to find what they would like to do in the future and how to develop their professional careers. So it's an experimental place where the idea is not to give classes but to make them feel very comfortable and build a very strong foundation for their future careers. I wasn't interested in uh, robotics, uh, but when I um, came to my brother's presentation, I just fell in love with this place because uh, the coaches were so motivational and the atmosphere was so great and uh, like uh, you can build everything that you want and uh, you can program it, it's, I think it's really cool. I see Tumo as a place where I can learn new things, make new friends and communicate with other people who have the same uh, interests I have. You can do some creative, crazy things that you can't do anywhere else in Armenia. There are many children in Armenia that have uh, talent and it must be progressed, so Tumo is a great place for it. My biggest dream is to have a big workshop where there are a lot of lots of machines and there I can run my imagination wild and create whatever I want. For me personally, Tumo is a place where you uh, can do anything you want because they give you the opportunity, they give you everything you need, the knowledge and uh, here at Robotics specifically you can get the materials. It all started three years ago when Ari came to Tumo and decided to start a workshop to just learn the levels of different sound. But then he decided to continue it and what we have today is the Tumbata. Here is the result. I think Tumbata sound is unique because we create our songs uh, with mixing the songs of different cultures of different countries. First we learn about different countries, about their cultures and then we get inspired from their music and mixing them with our own uh, Armenian folk songs, we make something new. Arik has created a new way of teaching in uh, most musical schools. They uh, teach uh, to children just to play instruments, then they don't make them to feel the music. So in Tumbata we feel, we really feel the music. Tumbata for me it's not just a band. Tumbata it's an educational program for me. We learn about folk and world music in general, like not only Armenian, not only Georgian. In general, what is folk? Because the folk is the root, and folk is the, the main thing we should know. I wanted to join this band too much, and also to come to Tumo uh, to participate in some workshops. So for me, Tumo is a place where you can freely express yourself, you can share your beliefs, your interests, and find new friends. It gave us a lot of opportunities to travel, to to learn music, and to participate in many workshops. There is no life without Tumbata. <laughs> when I was 12, I started to come to Tumo, and in this three year period, I've had the chance to try out the most different fields little by little. I feel very free here and I feel very comfortable and uh, not depend on other things. When I first came here, I was uh, very shy. I couldn't work with team. Uh, but in these three years, I became more independent and I found many friends and I learned how to work in team. I never 
thought that I will participate in Muay Thai workshop. I just saw the, uh, that uh, Intimo will be a programming workshop and I registered. It was calling Engineering Mind and Body. When I first go to the class, uh, they said that it is also Muay Thai. We were learning JavaScript programming and Muay Thai at the same time. And I started to attend and I really liked it. And um, our slogan was healthy body, healthy soul. When I started to attend in these workshops, I feel like uh, it was much easier to write code. I was more brave. <laughs> My work is programming and my passion is animation and character design. I've designed a few collections of characters. I make dinosaurs, raccoons, potatoes and now I'm working on parrots. I like animation from very young ages and I even make a, a flip books at school. I started to learn artificial intelligence basics and I made a tic-tac-toe game which could play with player and can win. I wanted to make a, an artificial intelligence which will be my friend. Uh, the one character I designed in this summer was my favorite. I liked it very much. Uh, that was a character from uh, Armenian legend Parvana. Uh, it was a warrior character. I decided to do programming, to write code, to write it with JavaScript, PHP, HTML, CSS, and I knew that it would be very difficult. Everybody is different here. For example, uh, coaches are like our friends, not our teachers. I was very shy two years ago. Uh, I have never sung in front of many people. Now I can probably say that I can sing uh, in front of them with less difficulty. Tumo is a place where you can be free, where you can learn whatever you like, and what you can't learn in another places in Yerevan, Armenia. Here I can proudly say that I've learned more about programming and writing code. Tumo has changed my life. <laughs> my dream is to have a big studio uh, in the future where I can work hard and where I can work with my friends who will be also musicians. I would like to earn a living doing what I would like to do. Tumo is a cool place. Tumo is a place for me to be myself and uh, express my creativity. A place where can I meet my friends. I Kids seem to love working with their hands. We have 12 to 16 year old kids who actually worked on these furniture. Well, actually, the way we do it is there's three levels, and when they finish level three, they're supposed to do their own project. I see the opportunity we can give to kids. I love giving whatever I have to the kids to see where they can go with it. And I love that. I love seeing their potential, their growth, and eventually at the end of a class, so when a kid comes and says, this is what I want to end up doing, that's amazing for me. In Nation Chats Ice Workshop, I have a design for I'm very passionate about my job. No matter what I do, I do it with passion because I think that when you love your job, it is not only a job for you. Students here, they can discover themselves, show it to the world and to do a lot of new stuff and become great people. I see that students who come here, they are so little. They are only about tw uh, 12 or 13 years old and they know a lot of things. It will be great if they use their knowledge that they get here to make Armenia and actually to make the world a better place. 
we help the students to understand everything and I try to help them to understand what they want, what they can do. Sometimes people come here, they learn some new things and even become specialists of that aspect and that's one of the greatest things that Tumo can give. It means a lot to me to help others to understand what they want, what they want to do. And as a coach, I'm doing it and I hope I'm doing it good. My biggest dream since childhood have been to become a singer. Actually, it's my passion to sing, to play the guitar. Most of all, I like to sing rock and metal. But now it has been already a year that I like our Armenian folk music and I sing it. It's really beautiful and we can find some really good stuff to listen, to sing, to let the world know it. What inspires me about Tumo is that I actually see the results of the work I'm putting in. And those results, it's not something that'll go away tomorrow or the next day. It's something that's going to have lasting effect on actual future generations. For me, Tumo is that place where these youths can come and hopefully find that little bit of direction in life that they need, that little bit of hope that they need. And to understand that they are part of a larger fabric. They are not separate. They are not lost in the small little republic. No, they're part of something bigger. I can learn everything in Tumo because I learned how to learn. I found my passion in Tumo. It was very good for me. Uh, I found TEDx. I'm now a TEDx team member and it is very interesting to uh, be part of uh, TEDx events. I am a concept art anti-corruption I like typography, calligraphy, lettering, uh, graffiti, everything that's uh, connected uh, with graphic design. Our future goal is to become a company like Marvel and DC Comics and we have original ideas and we want it to be real. The light and the, and the smile on those kids faces, the parents that are telling us what are you doing, it's amazing what happened, uh, how you're doing it, what have you done with our kids, those are things that are, you know, I, I, cannot, I cannot put value on them, they're amazing. We really want now to focus on university students level also. This is the foundation for university. And then we want also to be involved at, at the university level so that we make sure that we completed the cycle. This is a place that happens when we get a lot of people that believe in what we're doing, that have the same passion. So it's not about one person, it's not about only me or Sam or my colleagues. It's about all of us. It's about the parents, it's about the students, it's about the workshop leaders, it's about the staff, it's about all of us and all of us putting their maximum, their best uh, into this. Everything we do is for the future of this new generation. Everything.
Ramsey, 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 Rams